What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the JRD Motorsports vlog. Today we are getting the race car wrapped. Uh, no decals on it yet, but we're getting all the design work done and, and get that all laid out. Before we get into that though, for everyone who is here and has seen our previous vlog, we are going NASCAR Pinty Series racing. And I am unbelievably excited. We're going to be doing it in a DJK racing car. Uh, DJ Kennington, two-time NASCAR Pinty Series champion. Douglas Window and Door Inc. has come on board to uh, extend their partnership with us in a big way and make that happen. We're looking for more marketing partners, obviously, for it. Uh, September 24th, Delaware Speedway. We are going NASCAR Pinty Series racing. It's a big jump. It's uh, something we are super, super excited about, though. So uh, if you haven't seen that vlog, go back and check that out. I don't even know what to say. Dreams do come true if you work your ass off and you work hard enough and you find people that believe in you. Dreams yeah. do come true. So uh, make sure make sure you keep with it. Make sure you, you do your own thing and make sure that uh, believe. Believe that anything's possible and believe that uh, you, can, you can get there. So uh, we'll have lots more coming out about that. And uh, I, can't, I can't believe it's happening. But um, in the meantime, let's get wrapping our super stock because we got a whole season of super stock racing to do too. Today we are putting the design on our number 28 super stock. We're going to kind of walk you through the ins and outs of how we make that happen. We're by no means professional vinyl installers, but uh, we've had good success with it over the last few years and our cars always look good, we think. So we're going to take you a little bit through the ride today. It's quite the long process because we do wrap the car ourselves. We just find it's cheaper than dropping it off somewhere to get it wrapped and we like doing it. So um, let's go for a ride. Let's, uh, let's get this thing looking sexy. Jay's detail shop in the house. Safety first. Wearing gloves, obviously, because we're using some uh, some good chemicals to make sure this stuff sticks to the plastic. It's cutting time. We got a mix here of Avery vinyl because it was cheaper than the 3M for the white, and it's white. And then I'll show you later. Top secret. Stay tuned. Our blue is gorgeous. That's 3M stuff. 2080 vinyl. But uh, where'd my knife go? Right here. All right, we got the first panel done, minus the headlights. We haven't uh, done vinyl in a while, so we did that one without showing you, so that now we can confidently say we're ready to vinyl. We're gonna use this 3M cut tape. What's it, 3M knifeless tape? We've never used it before, but everyone always used to get mad at us and be like, what are you doing? So we're gonna attempt to use it. I've never used it, but I hear it's fantastic. So let's put our first line on. Oops, wrong angle. Having mixed results with this this 3M knifeless tape today. Uh, we're gonna see if it'll work this time. It will. Yeah, that's slick. All right. Every year we usually have switched our blue up a little bit, um, kind of match the Douglas color as our, as our primary partner stuff. But we found a new blue that is Douglas blue, but like super cool for the race car. So this is the blue. I'm really excited about it. This is going to pop really, really good. It's basically the same as last year, just more metallic y. Um, should look good. We wanted something a little more pop to it since we, we have a black body this year. So I think this is just going to look super, super good under the lights. And uh, this combined with the white and black, we got lots more going on. And that 3M knifeless tape it turns out is pretty awesome. So we can do some more fancy designs. So I'm going to cut this piece off. This will be our door piece. Yeah. 
Oh, it's close static into me. Grab it. <laughs> The blue is attracted to me. Listen, Jay. Sorry. I didn't ask. <laughs> okay, we gotta get this one right. So. Where's our line? Right here. That is it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, way down there. What are we thinking here, boys? Look at this. I love that blue. Good job, Frank. Thanks. Good job, Jay. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, I don't know if I have it. They'll be over there. Okay. What are you guys doing? I'm trying to make your seat super speedway safe. Super speedway safe. <laughs> Getting her all put back together and tightened up. Making a few more modifications to the bottom there to make sure I'm comfortable. This side of the car, not as pretty. So one side at a time. So what we do, I'm sure professional places do it different, but what we do with the race car, because sometimes you'll wreck a panel and you need to take one panel off. And also because it saves vinyl, we do each individual panel separately. We wrap each panel on the car. So like, for example, we're just putting this piece on now for the rear quarter. And the seam here, we'll wrap to that seam, we'll cut through the seam, then we'll wrap this a little separate piece. You can just see we got the door done here. So we wrap each individual panel. I mean, aluminum doors, if you wreck a door, I don't want to have to rewrap the entire side of the car. So the door is now wrapped, minus missing a big number. And then we will wrap that, wrap that, wrap that, and then eventually we have an entire car. So. Uh, we're gonna get this this part done and then uh, we'll do a little bit rest of our white and then this side of the car is pretty much done and ready to go you can really see this blue underneath the lights in here frank's taking this filming really serious <laughs> oh come on that's the worst All right, look at this. We got the deck lid all wrapped now. Just put new pins in. Oh, I did it again. No, it didn't. New pins and lanyards on it. Not pins, stuff plates. So what do we do? Do we want this to go like this? So we go like this. Like that. Boom. Well, it is like 10 o'clock at night or something and these two guys are still here with me everyone just left not too long ago but we wanted to keep her going so i'll flip the camera around and show we got almost well we got one side basically done and then well there's no there's no decals yet but and then the other side is is getting there and the front's done minus the hood so here i'll flip it around and show everybody there we go we got the whole front done here Sh looking schmexy we gotta get our headlight decals in there and then that's pretty much done and then this here is looking phenomenal. I'm super, super happy with that. That looks awesome. See it all the way back here. Yeah, that blue pops so good, so good. You can see here, all good. We just gotta finish this little bit of a back. We even got the deck lid all done as we showed. And then the other side of the car, we got this part all done and then we got that far, so this is done. This is done, so we're getting there. But big night in the shop, big day in the shop. We've been out here since Frank. What time did we come out here? Uh, nine. Nine thirty. We started at like nine thirty a.m. today, and it's now what time? Eight twenty-two. Eight twenty-two. I said like ten, so I'm a little early, but like eight thirty we worked out tonight. So that's a good, good solid day of wrapping. Obviously, we are not as fast as some people would be wrapping a car, but like I. It's so the way we do it. We have fun doing it. We like doing it. So, um, anyways, that is it for another day here in the Jared Motorsports Shop. We appreciate everybody clicking on this upload and uh, sub uh, supporting us. I wanted to say subscribe, but you should also do that. So hit that subscribe button for us. Like this video. Check out JaredMotorsports.ca. And uh, yeah. Have a great night.
Frank says have a great night. Well, it is nighttime.